Galileo, a wise mathematician, once said, Mathematics is the language with which God has written the universe. The beauty and elegance of mathematics not only unites the laws of nature, but is a form of art. You can code entire walls with symbols that can be solved and proved. Its beauty is a challenge for us to discover something new every day. Our thought process can be modified to see math in the most mundane aspects of life. We cannot deny the architecture and objects around us involve math. Yet we continue to struggle in every generation from kindergarten through college. What is the secret for success in mathematics? We hope this video will help you find the right resources to succeed in your math courses and eventually teach you to appreciate the world we live in through the eyes of mathematics. Hey, what's up? I'm about to cry. Why? What's wrong? I was fine in high school. Now that we're about to start college, I'm really worried about my first day at UBC. Jen, you did fine in high school. You'll be fine in college. There's not just starting college that's worrying me. It's my math class. I know I'm not great at math, and I'm going to need a lot of help. I don't know where to go for that help. Um, you know what? Don't worry about it. I think I know someone. I'll introduce you to. Hey, can you help me and my friend? Yeah, what's wrong? She has some major math problems. I just don't know how to be successful at math in college. Well, it's easier than 3.14. What's that? It's pi. You'll learn about it in your math class. We even have an annual pi day, which is March 14th. Oh, all right. Well, then I'll leave you two to talk. Wait, you're going to need this information as well. The first thing you need to do in order to become successful in your math class is actually going to class. At first, I was worried, but then I found about I found out about a math success center, and it helps me to prepare myself for upcoming exams. I even do most of my homework in there, and there's little study groups that are also performed in there. It's a big way to help you in math. What's the math success center? It's where you can solve most of your math problems that you have. So I just have to go to the Math Success Center and go to my classes and I'll pass the class. Well, it's not that easy. You also have to do your homework and put 110% of effort into schooling and then you can be able to pass the class. But I do, the, I do homework at home all the time. But it's different when you do it when the tutor's right next to you because you get that instant feedback. Not only that, but you're able to excel in your classes quicker. But math makes sense when I'm in the class, and then I go home, and I don't know what I'm doing on the paperwork. And then let's not talk about tests. I just get so nervous when I go to take them. I don't know what to do about it. Well, you have nothing to worry about if you do your homework at the Math Success Center. And plus, the tutors are there, and they're going to help you prepare yourself for your exam. Due to COVID-19, schools are closed and courses are now offered online. We as students are fortunate that the Math Success Center is still available to us through Canvas on the VBC website. I'm a student who spends any available time at the Math Success Center, either preparing for future assignments or moving forward in my homework. I have found that the Math Success Center offered at Victor Valley College is helpful when you're having difficulties with homework or practicing for quizzes and exams. 
Math Center will be there to help students work through problems and guide them to correct solutions. But how you got there is just, just as important as the answer itself, as it allows you to solve similar problems in the future. So the whole meet with a tutor thing that was intimidating and terrifying. I was scared that I was going to be judged or feel, um, I don't know, unintelligent. They were really there to help us and make us feel better about math. And if I can do it, I think any student coming into VVC, if they used all the resources given to them, I think that there's no reason why any student should leave feeling unsuccessful or bad at math. Uh, partnering with my professor and utilizing the tutoring center were the main things that allowed me to be successful besides willing to put in the effort that it took to get through the course. I decided to go back to school uh, at the age of 54, so I pretty well lost everything and forgot everything that I didn't learn in high school. I started out with C's and I finished up uh, all the way through to statistics uh, with an A. That math center really dialed in everything. I would recommend everybody spend time at the math center if you want to succeed in your classes. More importantly though, if you want to learn. Hi, my name is Nabil Asal. I moved here from Morocco in 2014. Back home, I always believed that I was hopeless at math. I was motivated to succeed because one of my American friends told me that she had not done well in high school math either, but in college she did well. In Morocco, the mindset is that if you don't get math at first, you will never get it, so you cannot study anything like science which requires math. That meant I could not be a doctor, which had been my goal, but at VVC, I had wonderful teachers like Professor Anne Weiss who explained everything so clearly that I got A's in all seven of my math classes. Hi, I'm Michaela. I just recently took Math 105 online um, via VVC summer course. I am a student at VVC and I am currently living in Australia for the time being. And I was able to take this class successfully. Um, it was time difference, I would have to figure out how to get, what time to get up in the morning to take this class. It was an afternoon class and that means it's an a.m. class for me over here. And then um, I had a lot of amazing tutors that I was able to see even from over in another country who were able to help me and fix my mistakes on tests. I had a professor who would meet on extra hours, professor wise. She would um, allow students to meet with her outside of normal class time to be successful in math and that just really helped me and I was able to pass the class really well because of everything BBC had provided for me and I did it in another country and that is um, that was a hard thing like having to get up at 5 a.m. some days but it was worth it because I passed the class and if I was always taught if we put in the effort, we will get the most out of life. And VVC definitely allows a student to have that opportunity to put in the effort. And I am so thankful that I was able to take this class and pass it. And thankful for VVC and the tutoring center, the math success center, and my professor who allowed so much for us students to be successful.
They also offer it during the weekends, so you'll be able to get the help you need whenever you can. And when BBC returns, you'll be able to use the North Success Center and get that one-on-one -on -one help with a tutor if you need it. But right now, I'm just going to help you with your Zoom session, okay? Okay. First, go to canvas.vbc.edu. That'll take you to the Canvas webpage. Click on VVC Login. That'll take you to the login page. Enter your login information, including your username and your password. You'll see uh, a module that says Tutoring and Academic Support. Click on that and go to Comfort Zoom. From there, you can choose which tutorial session you want to join. We're going to join Math 105 Tutoring with Chris Farias. Hi, I'm Chris. How can I help you? Hey, Chris. I have some friends that are new to BBC. I was wondering if you could help them out. Sure. Let me talk about our services and hours of operation. We're open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday and Sunday from 12 p.m. to 5 p.m. We do walk-ins and one-on-one -on -one tutoring sessions. Our services include helping with homework assignments, test corrections, and review questions for your tests. Hi everyone, welcome to VBC. Now that Daisy's done helping her new friends Jennifer and Faith, let's sum up what we talked about. Here are the five ways to be successful in a math class here at VBC. Number one, go to every class meeting. Number two, do all of your homework in the Math Success Center. Number three, form study groups. Number four, attend the faculty workshops. Number five, go to your instructor's office hours. Did you know? Students who utilize the Math Success Center are 14% more successful than students who are enrolled in the same class and who do not visit the Math Success Center. So we'll see you in there. Thanks for watching.